I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hey, Brahmins, we are back for another week. It is the start of your third week of the third nine weeks. Um, huge congratulations to all of you who participated in the science fair last week. Um, it's, we went to the awards. Ms. Goggins and I were there at the awards on Friday. And man, really cool prizes that were given out. Lots of cash prizes that were given out. And I want to give a special shout out um, to the following students who were able to move on to the regional fair out South Florida State College in Avon Park on February 8th. So congratulations to Jasmine Desai, James Phillips, Isabella Puga, Jenna Larson, Lily Grace, Larson, Lisbeth Garcia, Lily Cobb, Aubrey Clay, Patrick Jascott, Lillian Maxwell, Hannah Williams, Jackson Holcomb, Tori Trent, Rosa Salas Garcia, Jenna Johnston, Brady Williamson, Sophia Caves, Catherine Montez de Oca, and Matthew May. So congratulations to you all. Special shout out to go out to Best in Show winners. So Best in Show for the Biological Sciences went to Jenna Larson. And best in show for the physical sciences went to Jackson Holcomb. So congratulations to you guys. That's it? That's it. <laughs> this is our first week back from break that we actually are here all five days. So let's make the best of it. Um, I have updated much of our data sheet for you guys, teachers. Um, a lot of those results from FAST 2 have already come through. I still have a few that are trickling in for makeups. But students, if you're curious what your score was as it compares to the first time you took it, ask a teacher. They will have access to that. Um, other than that, have a great week. Good morning. I got a couple of emails over the uh, the uh, weekend from one from JROTC. Leslie Detzer sent me an email and says that they had a competition. Shakayla and Michaela Smith finished first in dual exhibition. Alexis Hernandez third in individual and Leslie Detzer and her group third in their group and their uh, competition. So congratulations to all you JROTC guys. Wonderful showing there. We also had wrestling over at Suncoast where Clayton Wolf and Falco Frank won first place. Wesley Emerson, Rondre Morgan, Riley White, uh, Will Crum, Christian Martinez, and Thomas Crum all placed for the boys. And Nay Morris, Carly Eaton, Shania Kent, and Patrice uh, Lamb Cooper all placed for the girls. And Nay Morris was first place in her group. So congratulations to all. Wonderful showing for OHS. And tonight we have a wonderful SAC meeting at 530 if anybody would like to come. Girls basketball is at home as well. Yes, we have girls basketball tonight at home. I think that's at 630. Uh, varsity and um, freshman. Uh, um, 530 is what I got, unless it's I've changed. Heard. Unless it's changed. Okay. All right. Well, I'll, I'll check. check on that. Um, yeah. Maybe maybe it has been changed. So uh, we have uh, Ms. Coleman, our OHS graduation coach, coming to visit our classes starting tomorrow. So ask your math teacher today what day she'll be here to talk to you. Um, she's going to talk about grades, um, G GPA, how important that is, credits, all those things that you need those mid-year reminders of freshmen for what you're working for. Like I said, the 90% of you that are doing that are on track, um, she's just going to reiterate that you need to keep working hard. And those of you who aren't, she's going to give you some suggestions on how to get back on track so that hopefully we can get you to the main campus, um, at least by the end of summer school, possibly. But we are, that's our goal. So um, she'll be here to talk to you this week. So make sure you be thinking of questions you might want to ask her. All right. Freshmen, I need your names. Those of you that want to participate in Heritage Day, if you have something special you want to showcase about our local heritage or your local heritage in some way, 
please make sure that you go in and find an email from me sent last week and you're just gonna fill out a form. You can do things like showcase small animals or bring some kind of food. Um, just keep in mind that you will need to have a parent or guardian to help you with those things. Food will need to feed 500 plus-ish. So please make sure that you keep those things in mind, but please go in and let me know if you are wanting to get involved. Um, sooner, the better. Thanks so much and have a great day. There is only one girls varsity basketball game today. So it, it starts at 630. I found the email. Vicki, you're right. <laughs> All right, teachers, this is just a reminder for um, team leaders and department heads. There is an SLT after school today. I think I left that out of this week's bulletin. All right, make it a good one as together we move forward. And be great. And be comments. All day. All day. Oh.